We're here with Coach David Lynn after the Eagles are um, back on top, uh, winning the Great American Conference preview. And Lord, uh, Coach, it's been a while since we could say we won a tournament. Um, we're dating, you know, we didn't do that last season. Um, nice to be back in the W column. Gloria, March of 2016. Yeah, it's been a while. Um, we didn't win one last year and broke a streak. Um, it's nice to come out and, and win right off the bat. Um, you know, we had 11 guys playing out there and they were really together as a unit. And it was uh, impressive to see the way. We didn't get off to a great start, the A team. Um, and we shot 31 under, I think, the last two rounds. And so that's that's pretty impressive. I was very, very, very pleased. The A team, they had the second and third best rounds in relation to par in program history. Um, that's pretty impressive. I don't care what course you're on. No, it's impressive. And we played Lincoln West. A lot of our records were set at Lincoln West and River Oaks. And, you know, we haven't played Hefner. This is the first time that we played a collegiate event here that I can remember. Um, you know, we just, the golf course is good. The greens are good. And we just got no wind for two days in Oklahoma, which just never happens almost. But the, the weather was perfect. Uh, the guys are actually pretty sharp. I was, I mean, I don't know what else. I mean, I'm a little bit dumbfounded at the scores, to be honest. Like 40 under or something that we shot. Um, you know, multiple 66s and 7s, and it was just really great to see. Juan Pollock uh, was tied for second. Garrett White was tied for fourth. And he had some good individual play. I think we had five kids in the top 12. Yeah, you you know, Juan was 15 under, and Garrett, and to be honest, uh, Juan has looked great. He looked great in qualifying. He looked great all three rounds. He had three under, six under, six under. You know, he wasn't missing many shots, and he was making putts. So, I mean, he's, he's come back for his junior season, and I think he's, obviously, he's ready to go. I, I was very impressed. Garrett is a transfer from Tyler. He's got a lot of experience. This golf course really favors him because he can smash, kind of smash and grab it. Um, you know, and then Cameron came back uh, the last two rounds with 68, 66, I think. So he was 10 under the last two, and that's that's very impressive uh, to me. We also, like you said, we mentioned, uh, had a lot of guys. Andreas Brixton in his first college tournament had, I think he was six under. Ryan Trousdale was seven under in his total. Uh, he had a very nice event, 67, 72, 70, I think. And so, yeah, very impressed all the way down the line with a lot of those guys. And we want to give some love to the B team. <laughs> the B team actually outplayed the A team in the first round, and two of those guys in the top 12 were B team players. That's right. Um, That's th right. There's going to be a lot of competition on this team this year. There is. I mean, you, you know I've said that before. I, I love to have 10, 11 guys that um, not, interchangeable is not the right word, but they're competing. They're getting better at practice every day. They're competing in putting games and playing nine holes and whatever that might be. That makes you. That, that's what gives you the opportunity to compete and play well and shoot the kind of scores we're shooting and everyone's getting pushed. And so, yeah, some serious B team love. They played great. And I just went straight off the qualifying scores. I didn't I didn't change anything up. And so I, I knew that maybe some of that might happen, but that's exciting when, you, as a coach, you're not worried about it. You feel like you can kind of slip anybody into the lineup and, and you, you have a chance to win. And we proved that this week, so. Well, I say, we got the win and now it's on to the next tournament, but it's, it's a good way to start the season. It's a great way to start the season and should give the guys some momentum and, and get their confidence high. And that's what we're looking to do going into Western Washington in a couple weeks. Well, hey, congratulations, Thank Coach. Thank you. Appreciate it.